You know, I think polycythemia vera is a, a disease we've been treating for a long time with the goal of reducing thrombotic risk, right? And and recently we've we've kind of added to that goal the idea of improving quality of life, right? Um, and I think it's something that that you know we have agents that we think can really mitigate the thrombotic risk. I think we have uh, some agents that can help with quality of life in terms of kind of more marked symptoms such as fevers, chills, night sweats, bone pain. But I think some of the challenges that remain are uh, a couple things. One, symptoms such as fatigue, brain fog, lack of concentration. I mean, these are things that plague patients. Uh, and, and, and unfortunately, we don't have great therapies for that. Right? And I think one of the areas that we can kind of think about when we're targeting to target that is, is this something different than, than, our cur what, than, than kind of the targets of what our current agents do? Um, and that's where I think agents such as Rusfertide and some agents targeting the hepcidin pathway may be able to kind of uh, look at these symptoms that are a bit underappreciated, right? And, and, and provide maybe a benefit uh, in addition to what we see with some of our other agents.